Okay, so here we are. All right, our oil is at just over 400 degrees, so it's a little hot. But probably okay. Probably okay. Now we have three gallons of uh, oil, and it's a mixture of uh, <coughs> vegetable, peanut, and sunflower oil. Mainly peanut oil, I believe. So, vegetable. Mainly vegetable oil. Okay. So right. down here we have a uh, 15 pound turkey. We've put a little Cajun spices on it. Mm -hmm. Kate rubbed them on the inside. Mm -hmm. Did an outstanding job. All right. So we have to insert the hook from the neck side, or I'm sorry, from the back side. Okay. Through the neck. Mm. And then, well, we need to glove this because it may splatter. So we have leather welding gloves we're using here. Okay. Now, this needs to be dropped in extremely and quickly, slowly. huh? Oh, slowly. I'm sorry. Except I think we've got it in upside down. We want to have a Go to the neck in first. Yes. Is that right, Kate? Yeah. I don't think it makes a whole lot of difference, does it? I don't. What sure? Make sure you get the wings in there now. Yeah. That's just the uh, water from the turkey. He's got one wing out, so it's not going to go in. And here we go. We're dropping it in the oil. Oh, baby, it's going. Sure I don't get oil on the camera lens. Okay, let her down. I am, slowly. It's flattening up the top. We gotta be careful. This could take a long time. It can take 10 minutes to get the turkey. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. As you can tell, this is our first attempt. And I like Tom's shoes because they have a nice vegetable oil coating on them. Though. Which will probably substitute for pot. There's a question of how much oil are we going to lose. Hopefully there's going to be enough left in there. Problem seems to be the neck hole. Yeah, well, that's where the water is coming out. She is basically boiling the water, I would imagine. Huh? Yeah. Just a very little bit at a time, and it's not going to squirt out. What if we just put dumped it in and ran? <laughs> it's easy to say from the guy who's not getting oil on it. <laughs> I've been recording for four minutes, and we're about halfway in. Whoa! I'm backing up. And please note that we're doing this inside, <laughs> inside the pole barn. You're supposed to always do it outside. We are not professionals, so don't try this at home. Pick up the But the way I look at it, the pole barn's made out of metal. There's not a whole lot that can burn in here. Except human skin. <laughs> and actually the uh, turkey and oil smells better than the grease and oil that I normally smell in here. Alright, back up to you, okay? We're getting we're getting in there, guys. 
We're now up to five minutes and that baby's just about under under oil. All right, there it is. Five minutes right on the money to dump it in. It's still spewing water. Water, or oh, I think it's oil, water mix. But smells good. Now, are we keeping time? What time is it? <laughs> 336. We need and it's been in there for well, is it, is it time after no, now? Right now. We had an 11 pound turkey, we waited before we put well, it in. Well, it was 15 to start, but we took all the neck and yeah. giblets out. And... So it's 11 pounds. Okay, so it's in and it's cooking. Okay, it's been about 25 minutes, and our oil is at 350 degrees, and the turkey's looking nice and brown. We've lost some of the oil. It's from the top. Burned off. Evaporated off. But as Tom said, who eats the front of the shoulders anyway? Okay. And I'm sure that'll cook just fine. So We have uh, about, 15 minutes, about 15 minutes left. 20 minutes maybe. So we'll let it cook. And then we have our special guest, the duck. Who's going to go in after the turkey comes out. Mm -hmm. And the duck is, uh, the duck takes Six minutes a pound? Five to six, minutes, five to six pound. minutes a pound. Our duck is three pounds. So it'll take about 15 or 18 minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's been coming up on 38 minutes that we've had the uh, turkey in the oil. Let's see if I can zoom in. It looks delicious. Nice and brown. The skin is brown. We've lost, again, some oil off the top, but it's not a big deal. The breast is still under, under oil. So in about 30 seconds, Tom's going to pull it out. Again, Tom, be very careful. <laughs> Even though you are a professional. I'm an untrained professional. An untrained professional, nonetheless. Right, get our pan ready so we don't drip all over the floor. On my pants. Okay, we have about 30 seconds, so Tom's a little early. It's a little premature with his <laughs> pull out. But... <laughs> Be patient, Tom. Okay, 15 seconds and counting. Again, we'll do a little zoom in. Still bubbling like crazy. It doesn't appear to be floating, like they said. No, the duck floats. Oh, the duck turkey. floats, not the turkey. Turkeys don't float. <laughs> we found that out. So. Wood does. Okay, it's time, Tom. You're late. Here comes the turkey out of the oil. Oh, look at that baby. Look at that brown bird. Oh, my God. Let me go around the other side. It's beautiful. Okay, so Tom's going to drop that into a roasting pan. And then we'll take it up to the house. Now we're going to put the duck in. So here's our duck, which is three pounds. And again, Tom, slowly... The duck does not float until it's done cooking. It's kind of ironic because ducks float when they're alive, but not when they're dead. Okay, okay he just dumped it right in there. He didn't even wait. Good. So it's uh, 4.15 we're starting at. And we're going to cook this for roughly 6 minutes, about 18 minutes. Starting at 4.15. Okay, so here we are. All right, our oil is at... Just over 400 degrees, so it's a little hot. But probably okay. Probably okay. Mm -hmm. Now we have three gallons of... Uh, oil and it's a mixture of uh, <coughs> vegetable, peanut, and sunflower oil. Mainly peanut oil, I believe. So Vegetable. Mainly vegetable oil, okay. So right. down here we have a 15-pound uh, turkey. We've put a little Cajun spices on it. Mm -hmm. Kate rubbed them on the inside. Mm -hmm. Did an outstanding job. 